Hello and welcome to another exciting episode of Fargo Retro Plays Stellaris. We are on the twelfth episode here of our Alliance of Pacifica playthrough uh, as the Uplifted here, and we are just slowly expanding our space here. We've we've filled in this back pocket. We've we figured out why uh, these uh, the Vulcans here. Um, let's see. But, uh, yeah, we're just, uh, I'm not going to go over a lot of exposition. If you need some exposition, go into episode 11 here at the beginning. That'll kind of explain what's going on. Didn't really accomplish a ton other than sort of passive expansion. Nothing, nothing big happened other than our planet Struggle, which we were intending to have as a continental planet. Rint Beacon. It's another set of pirates. Damn it. Well, we're going to move the Alliance fleet up to Belgium as well. Move the scout fleet down to Hadnanak. That little space between us here. Ugh, and they always go for me. Scientists passed. Get her going on that one. to bring those up to star fortresses for a very nominal benefit uh, at this point. Um, that is... So click here. They're down here. You aid us in our research. Yes, we would like to purchase a service. For 10 years, we should get a pretty decent research boost then. Cost of 2,000 uh, energy. just arrived and we'll go ahead and see what if anything we can do to these jerks we look like we're stronger than them so they've got a slight advantage we have a tech advantage but they have a they have a capacity advantage so yeah it's like their ships were better suited than mine to to do whatever it is we're doing Expecting an emergency retreat here, buddy. Where you at? Lost two Corvettes. That's okay. Move him while he's in transit. They are a distance away, so... Is lame. There's 
nothing that can be auto explored. The last three species for this this are um, in enemy space. We're gonna have to hold off on that a little bit. Planets in sectors output. Yamasera Prime. Struggle. Pacifica. Assistant research in Pacifica. In Belgium. Suitors. The last one you're gonna actually want to go towards uh, that struggle. Ugh. But we have a lot of resources up here yet to harvest, so that is good to go on that front. ourselves a unity tradition here star base influence cost reduced by 10 effect uh, on tradition cost caused by number of colonies is reduced by a fifth or new colonies start but let's do that because we've really expanded our colonies here pretty quickly so we are gonna pull that back a little bit are they just are they trying to destroy my station then yeah they must be clicks out are you quite a bit quite a bit fleet in Belgium's repairing but they did take some losses so let's go take a look at that scout fleet pull that down one camp Build some ships, huh? Construction complete. cap up over with the uh, wool gun anchorages. Technology discovered. Cruisers. Originally devised as an experimental next generation colon ship hull, blah blah blah. That is good. Toss is good. Destroy hull points plus two. Beef up our ships a bit. Krogan. A lot of people on this planet, then. Got ourselves a Krogan, even. So that is fun. Attic resilient. Y'all shouldn't be on that science, though. Y'all can be up here cooking up some food. It's not the best spot for you. Yeah. Science lab. Food. Pumping out some ships to increase the size of our fleets here. Um, we fail. Oh, Discovery chance. Research speed. Survey speed. 
some labs there. Go point the fence. Do some upgrades. Some more upgrades. Upgrade that. to anchor at Belgium. Just cruising away here. Um, not a ton needs our immediate attention. Uh, we're way over on our ship production, but that is okay. Gotta, gotta get them a little stronger. Just have to. So that's okay if we take a little bit of a penalty here. Send the scouts to support once the Alliance fleet gets here. Construction complete. Stinda, they're back. fun. I want that. Right. Construction complete. I do more social media here.
just to get that space closed out, not a done, and then we just have to worry about pirates and expansion this way. We got past those lurkers, huh? I guess we probably should as well. I just didn't want to expand that way since we're still filling stuff in yet. But that is oogie dookie. Return and return. Those ships repairing. If there's any immediate targets here, must have. There's a 19, 21, 23. Yeah, some decent planets. So 24 and Algol. So let's clear this up and get get moving. Found somebody up here, huh? We can hear their transmissions, but we don't know quite who they are. That's fun. Uh, whoops. We're not allowed to resettle, are we? Um, Stuftia Prime. Where'd you go? Where'd you go? Build Pop. Drill Robot. Or, or those fleets are thickening up a little bit. That's good. Good, good, good. Really getting some mineral maintenance, though. That's fun. Braylix, okay. Expand it that way. So let's move you this way. Kinds of stuff to build on that planet. Technology discovered. Point defense is up, so we can increase. Ooh, wormhole travel. That's uh, uh, naturally occurring subspace wormhole is a fickle thing, and its fluctuating energy levels typically make it impossible to travel safely between its linked aperture. There are, however, ways to, tem to temporarily stabilize its matrix. Yeah, have to grab that. Have to grab that. So what that's going to allow me to do is I have this wormhole in my space specifically and one up here there's a couple down here so we might have to fight for these ones but they should just that way too okay
decent research going on here. Not gonna lie. See what do we got here? Mineral processing plant two, another research for kinetic weapons, destroyer build speed, rail guns, improved cruiser hulls, or we could backfill some of this stuff here. So let us two nineteen, that's really coming down. But let's do that. Lamb, it looks like. Construction complete. Built some foods just cuz. Construction complete. Okay. Take it from there. Might need to retire one after this just because we are Found the Silistrans, the Soro Sub Corporation. Ooh wee! Nice little chunk of space up there. Small influence cost to, to improve relations with them. Construction complete. Okay, what do we got? We got an insult from the Zerg. Not interested in that. Scientists went down. station there. Fleets are looking nice and party. Well, we should combine them. And then fleet manager. Got rid of that template. It might still be ships on the way to to combine with, huh? fleet and there we go and that is the alliance fleet they got a 
chance of getting a lion's fleet. some platforms I guess upgraded ships upgraded Looks good. doing more more grinding up. We're getting Midco installed there, so that's what that noise is. We're finally getting Midco in this building, so I'm I'm really excited about that. It should be a big boon for my streaming and, and all that jazz, so. Passively upgrading stuff. That that's got a number of upgrades that are on the horizon yet. So we'll we'll hold off on that, and then we'll look at making maybe a sector or two because I think Tews and Bagapia um, or Tews, the uh, Oskosia Prime and Sakti Prime systems. I don't really need. Um, it's more. Ants destroyer hulls, maybe engineering facility. Rare attack. Let's do it. Grab advanced destroyer hulls. That seems like a nice boon. Um, the destroyer, I think, is a little more useful of a ship in this uh, in this format of game here. So, or in this version of the game. Where are civilian ships? Uh, they are just inherently building building they stuff to they to they direction. To the existing direction. Unity. Construction complete. Okay. Just keep Materials experience. That's nice. Gene mod points plus one. Um, big fan of that. Big fan of that. Hypercom forum. We'll go with that. Uh, it also means that we have um, some more points here. So let's take a look. Beneficial trait. Krogan. delete these ones here just because we haven't used them yet. Modify, delete. Well, let's see here. So we're the natural sociologists. The firstborn are going to be our engineers. So these guys will be our physicists. Uh, firstborn. So we'll create a template here. We're going to give them intelligent. We're going to give them physicists. Engineering, sociologist, physicist. Uh, what else would be a good? We got three points and two peeps. 
Three points, two peeps. template for them. Let's apply the template to all planets. Um, can we modify their glandular? Okay, so we couldn't even do that anyway. Apply templates. Let's go. Log updated. Nice cushy deal, you're just giving them nothing. happened here in this episode either uh, we just continue to uh, thicken up our space here uh, we're starting our northern process of expansion now it's hoping to get the wormhole research done but I think we're at our 30 minute mark here um, yeah quite a bit over so I need to get to school and stuff so I'm gonna take a shower and do all that jazz do some research I got a uh, midterm today so I'm, I'm pretty much very much looking forward to that uh, midterm tomorrow and all that stuff so stuff of note filling in this space here uh heading to the north found the sorrow soup so looks like we could have the start of a pretty nice little federation here if i don't end up absorbing the confederacy of vulcan as a as a target um just because they're they're kind of trapped in and kind of small here and uh, i don't want to necessarily leave them a ton of space of that i would want so Build that up. We are really coming along here, I think. Um, and as we get more planets and more species in on our planets, especially those Gaia, Gaia worlds, um, then we are able to... Um, have more people come into our empire and then we have more potential uh species that can help us on different planets so what we got here another arid Ugh. but uh yes yeah, so we'll just uh probably wrap this one up here uh at this point i just want to thank you for watching go ahead and like comment subscribe if you've been enjoying it um you know comments would be great uh if you've been watching this i'd be curious to see what you guys want me to do and i'd, I'd be happy to start uh doing some of that so um any feedback any feedback you guys have on these would be 
more uh, than appreciated. Um, I need a little bit left to do yet, huh? Wormholes. Okay, now let's just, uh... Gotta see what's on the other side of a wormhole, you know what I mean? So let's let's do that. Um, grab that tech real quick. So presumably... Presumably these need to go through first. So I, I will actually, you know, you know, acknowledging I just gave my wrap up spiel. Let us just see what's on the other side of this wormhole because it's the first time I'm doing this mechanic, um, and I really like the way it's it's gonna change uh, the nature of the game. You have your local space, plus you have your extended space, plus you have your advanced space. You'll and you'll see what that is with the gate gate system. Um, this is gonna be pretty cool, I think. It connects to the Oobleon system. Where? In the Zerg Swarm. On a fortress style world of theirs. Well, fantastic. So now I know this <laughs> needs to get upgraded to a military facility so we'll get that process started bring this guy back to first landfall Put some sciences there Food production almost. Strug struggles basically filled in. Increase the food production and struggle a little bit. Carnassian Union has declared war on the Zerg Swarm. Hmm, interesting. Be a good time to test my borders with them, but I don't think I will. Another election. Oh, it's our first foreigner too. That's fun. Here, see how that goes. So we're running a little, a little low on influence here. So we're we're having to slow down our expansion just a tad. So thank you for watching. Uh, again, like, comment, subscribe. Anything you want to see me do, let me know. I will probably not play this game uh, again until Friday. So, uh, But then again, you're probably not going to see any of those. Anyway, <laughs> thanks for watching. Take care.